Hey, what's going on, guys? It's Jake the Happy Snake here. It has been a super long time since I made a video, and the reason why that is is because I recently got a job. Uh, in the, uh, later on in September, I got a job, so I haven't made a video in quite some time. I can't remember the last time I made a video, but um, I've decided to get back into Pokemon card collecting. And the other night, I thought I would I would get something, so I saw this Fennekin Callow Starter set, and Fennekin is, like, my new favorite Pokemon, pretty much. It's, um, like, it's a starter I chose in Pokemon Y, and uh, Fennekin's really sick. I, I, I love him. Anyways, um, so yeah, uh, I, I've already opened it up and everything, um, but I am gonna show, I'm just going to show you guys some, like, the things you do get in the deck. Um, so I'll start off with the promos. You get the entire evolution chain of Fennekin, so we get the Fennekin Hollow here. Braxton Hollow. I'm not sure if I'm saying his name right. It could be Braxton. I'm not even, well, Braxton doesn't sound right, so I'm pretty sure it's Braxton. But anyways, that's pretty cool. Then you got Delphox. And I like Delphox a lot because Fire and Psychic, the first ever Fire and Psychic type Pokemon. It's taken 655 Pokemon to actually get a Fire and Psychic type, so I really, I think that's really awesome. Um, then you get this, uh, this is a, uh, well, this side is a checklist, and this side is, I'm not really sure, just, uh, well, it says changes in the Pokemon TCG X and Y series. Uh, if you're new to the Pokemon trading, I'm not new, I, I, my brother used to collect Pokemon cards, and that was like 10 years ago. Um, yeah, Fairy Energies, that was really awesome. Uh, that's pretty cool. I, I think, I, I like how they added the new Fairy type, uh, because fairy types are pretty cool. A lot of the old Pokemon are not fairy type Pokemon, which you guys probably are already knew. Anyways, you also get um, you also get damage counters, which I'm gonna throw out because I don't play the TCG. I just collect, so I'm not gonna need these at all, unless you guys want them. No, I'm kidding. And then you get this um, play match. Now this is gonna be super difficult. Back my camera up here. Um, this is gonna be extremely. Hard. Uh, here I'll just go like this. Wait, whoops. Is that upside? No, it's not. Okay. I thought it was upside down for a second. There it is. That's to play the game. But like I said before, I only collect, so I won't, I, won't, I won't need this either. But you know, some somebody might like seriously damage counters. That's pointless. Um, what else do I have to show here? You also get the uh, online code, which I don't play the PC, uh, the online TCG because it's complete bullcrap to me. <laughs> I, I'm not. I. I I don't play that at all, so I'm, I'm not going to need this, so I'm thinking, um, you know, in the near future I'm going to do a giant giveaway, uh, maybe in March when I have my, uh, my three year, three years, man, it's been almost three years since I've been on YouTube, I cannot believe that, but my three year, um, celebration, and I'll, or whatever, and I'll give away a bunch of codes. Um, you know, you, and I also got, I also, it also came with a Legendary Treasures booster pack, which I actually did not know it came with a booster pack, but that was pretty cool, and it came with another code card, so, yeah, I have two of those now, um, and you're not gonna believe this, my first Legendary Treasures pack, actually, my first pack in months, maybe even a year, and I pull, you guys know what's coming, a Black Kiram EX, I cannot believe that, like, my first Legendary Treasures pack ever, and I get this card, but you know what, um, I've heard people got really good pulls out of packs like this, like, I heard, oh, like, it's really common to get two EX cards, I think Prime Night Pokemon, I watched a video, he got, he got a EX card, an EX full, full art card, and a holo card in one pack, it's just in completely insane, <laughs> so I would buy a lot, a lot more of those packs, um, it also comes with a really awesome Fennekin coin, really cool, this coin's actually a lot bigger than the other coins, I, I've noticed, which, Pretty cool, I guess. So I like that. And of course, the main part of the whole package thing. Um, the deck. Not really much difference on the back. But anyways, yeah. Um, when I got the deck, it, all the cards were like out of order, so I re re rearranged them all for this video. But anyways, you get 12, uh, you get 12 fire energy cards. Like I put the deck down, actually. You get tw um, you get twelve fire fire energy cards. You get twelve darkness energy cards. You get four pokeballs. 
And this deck is pretty much worthless to me because I, like I said before, I only collect. But, you know, I guess you can do a lot more with the deck than you can with the stupid damage counters. Uh, you get a couple Tyranos. I think that's what you pronounce. I'm not really sure. You get a, a couple switches. I wonder what switches there are. Are they switches to the bathroom? Alright, that was not funny at all. Uh, you get a couple Pokemon catchers. Now, I've heard that Pokemon catchers are extremely rare, but obviously they're not. <laughs> I didn't think they were. And then now, here we come into the actual Pokemon. You get three Fennekins, three Braxons, uh, you get another Delphox, you get a couple Slugmas, a couple Panseers, you get four Puchinas, Uh, you get two Mighty Innis. Get a couple Inkays. No, or I'm not sure if that's the way you say his name, but when I got, okay, now, when I got this deck, and I saw that Inkay was, was dark this type, I searched it up in Bulbapedia, because I thought I could have sworn this thing was Fairy. I searched it up, and it's part Fairy and Psychic. This, or not, I'm sorry, part Dark and Psychic. Does this thing look like a freaking dark type Pokemon to you? No, it doesn't. Like, yes, a, a psychic and dark type is really cool, but seriously, this thing isn't. This thing does not look like a dark type. They could have at least made his typing on the card psychic type, but this deck is fire and darkness, so I guess it makes sense. Anyways, uh, you get a couple fletchings, and you get a couple furros, and that is it. So, thanks guys so much for watching. I am getting back into the trading card game. Um, but mainly for collecting, so I'm gonna I'm I'm considering buying the Chesspin and Froki decks, um, because you know I don't know I just feel like I need to get those two, and I might buy some more Legendary Treasures packs because like one pack and I got the freaking Z uh, Zekrom EX, which is amazing. I can't even find it now. Oh, here it is. Like this is amazing. Like I'm sorry, this is amazing. Like one pack and I get that thing. Um, and, I'm, my, and I'll try to get more packs just for the code cards, because I might do a giant giveaway for co for, for uh, code cards. And I know I did a giveaway uh, a few months ago. I had, like, four of them from, like, old packs that I opened, and I gave them away. So I might do that again. Um, but anyways, thanks, guys, so much for watching. And I am going to try to get back on my, uh, well, not daily schedule, but I'll, we'll buy a lot more packs and a lot more, um, a lot more like, collection boxes and stuff. Because um, now I have a job. I actually have money. So anyways, thanks, guys, for watching. Um, and stay tuned for more videos. Peace.